Amazfit GTR4 offers a lot of customization options when it comes to the watch faces. You can create your own watch faces using your photo or custom wallpaper. Or you can use Amaze Faces app to download some cool watch faces. All the settings and tutorials I will talk about in this video will also work on other Amazfit watches like T-Rex 2 and GTR 3. I have made a separate video for those watches as well, but the Amaze Faces app just keeps changing its user interface every 3 to 4 months. So let's start the video by discussing the stock watch faces. Holding down the watch face will show you all the watch faces available on your watch. Swiping the watch face above will bring you the delete option. This basically allows you to delete the watch face from your watch and free up the storage. Below some watch faces you will also find this edit button which allows you to edit the metrics on the watch face. Let me show you what I mean by that. By default this watch face shows you steps, heart rate and battery. Now if I hold the touch screen. The watch face will zoom out and bring you access to this edit button. As you can see, these two sub dials are now highlighted. Tap twice on whichever sub dial you want to customize. This will bring you various options to choose from. Whichever option you choose will replace the existing option. You can only customize all the highlighted sub dials. Different watch faces offer different customization options and some don't offer any. Now let's move on to how you can create a custom watch face on Amazfit GTR4. Open the Zap app and go to profile. Under Amazfit GTR4 screen, you will find the watch face option. Tap on it. Scroll below to find the custom background option. Tap on more. On the next screen, you will see various watch faces with left, bottom, top, center and right written below them. What it basically means is where do you want your watch face to display the time. So if you are using your photo, then you might want to select the bottom option, as it won't obstruct the view of your face. To show you how to do it, let's select the bottom. On the next screen, you will see this. Change the background of the watch face. Tap on the plus icon. It will present you with two options. First one is to take a photo using a camera and the second one is select from the gallery. I am gonna choose gallery and select a wallpaper as I don't like using my photos as the watch face. Once you have selected the photo, it will bring you back to the Zep app and now tap on the sync option. This will set the wallpaper or photo as your watch face. Now I want to show you an app called Amaze Faces. I will be leaving the link for the app down in the description below. Once you have installed the app, open it. On the first screen, the app will ask you to select your Amazfit smartwatch. In this case, it will be Amazfit GTR4. But if you are using some other watch, you select that. Tap on apply once you have selected your Amazfit model. Now you will see all the compatible watch faces for your Amazfit GTR4. But before you download the watch face, we need to add your smartwatch Bluetooth MAC address. To do that, go to settings option in the lower right corner. Here you will find a separate MAC address option. Open it. A pop-up will appear asking you to enter your Bluetooth MAC address. Finding the MAC address is pretty simple. Open the Zep app. Go to profile, Amazfit GTR4, scroll below and tap on the about the device option. Here you will find the Bluetooth address, enter it manually within the app. I would recommend writing it down somewhere and then copying it within the app. Once you have entered the MAC address, tap on save. Once you are done, you will find a separate permission tab under the Mac. There will be location and storage permission option with denied written under them. Tap on them one by one and make sure you give all the permissions to the app. That's it, you can now download any watch face on your Amazfit GTR4 watch. One thing to note here is that the watch face collection for Amazfit GTR4 is small right now in the Amazfaces app. As the watch is just launched in the market, it shouldn't be an issue in the long run. By the way, these watch faces do take up your internal storage. So I would recommend downloading and installing the watch storage app. It will give a breakdown of the storage used by the watch face, music, system and apps. Now let's discuss some useful settings that you as GTR4 owner should know. The first one is the ability to set different watch faces and always on display. So let's assume you have set an analog watch face but want a digital always on display or you have set a digital watch face but want an analog watch always on display. You can do that by going into the settings, display, always on and then the always on style option. On the next screen there will be two options, 
follow the watch face and style selection. Tap on the style selection and select the always on display you want to set. As you can see, I have an analog watch face but always on display is set to digital. The final tip is that you can schedule the always on display so it doesn't bother you at night and consume unnecessary battery as well. You will find the enable status option under the always on settings menu. You can set it in smart mode which disables the always on display whenever you take off the watch or it detects you sleeping. You can also set a custom schedule on which a display would be allowed to work. Pretty cool, right? So guys, that's it for today. I know the video was a little long. Hopefully you enjoyed it and found it useful. Before you go, do tell me in the comment section below whether or not you are going to be using the Amaze Faces app. And don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this on wearable tech. With that, it's time to say goodbye. See you next time.